Business News at 10. Thanks for joining us. I'm Rochelle Mircea. And I'm Dave Gonzalez. It is the biggest tax cut in 30 years, and it's heading to President Trump's desk tonight after the House passed the legislation earlier today. But what does this mean for the average Bakersfield taxpayer? Our witness News reporter Jeff Platt has those answers. Jeff? Well, Dave Michelle, a lot is happening in the tax reform bill, but for tonight, we're going to boil it down to how it affects your income and the amount of tax dollars you owe to the federal government. In order to show how the tax overhaul passed in Washington, D.C. affects us here in Bakersfield, we need a benchmark. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, this is what the average Bakersfield person looks like. They're married, they have one kid, and they have a household income of $58,000. So let's break it down with the numbers. Under the old law, if you make $58,000 and you're married, your standard deduction was $13,000. The personal exemption was $12,450, which makes your taxable income $32,550. Take off the $1,000 for the child tax credit, and you owe $2,930 of federal income tax. Over at Sandoval Tax in Bakersfield, CPA and tax preparer Joel Sandoval tells me much of this is going to change. The standard deduction has been doubled. The personal exemption has been eliminated. The tax brackets have been lower for individuals. If you were currently in the 25, you're now in the 22% tax bracket. Under the new law, if you make $58,000 and you're married, your standard deduction is $24,000. There's no more personal exemption, so your taxable income is $34,000. But your child tax credit doubles, and you pay a lesser percent of your income to federal income tax, which means you're only going to pay $1,699 in income tax. That's a tax break of $1,200. And $31. Of course, different incomes, marital statuses, and family situations will change the numbers, but Sandoval says it benefits most everyone. And don't worry, single people, your deduction is nearly doubling too. I would say for the majority of taxpayers, it's actually better. Uh, under different scenarios, you're going to see less taxes due for everyone. Now, if President Trump signs the bill, the new tax laws will take effect in 2018, but it will not affect your 2017 tax return. Even still, Sandoval suggests you consult a tax professional now and get out in front of the new laws. Reporting live in studio tonight, Jeff Platt, Eyewitness News. All right, Jeff. Meanwhile, I have